for your heel command. It's raining outside, so we'll explain it in here and then take a video out there, hopefully when it stops raining for a moment today. But heel means, hey Blue, I'm about to start walking. And we're going to play that game where you have to stay at my side. So you're not waiting for him to get to your side or to start walking with you or anything at all. He could be off gallivanting in a little field of flowers and you would just say, heel and start walking, whether he came with you or not. Heel means I'm about to start walking and we're doing the thing. So say heel and start walking. Keeping up a faster pace will help him more in the beginning. Slower paces are by far the hardest for him because he has to constantly watch and slow down his pace. So keep up a power walk in the beginning to help him coordinate this with you. And there are a few things that could happen during your heel. One is that as you're walking, he gets too far ahead of you. So we want him, come on, you're not going to climb again, come on. We want him staying about, okay, little buddy, come on. About right here is very good. He could be a little bit ahead of you as long as he's watching you so you can adjust your pace and see if he matches your pace if you're not sure if he's paying attention. But about that far, if he gets too far ahead where he's clearly not watching you anymore, come on upward, or he's and just way up there. The second that about his shoulder completely passes your hip, kind of like that. Now there's no way he can see you. He's not watching you, he's not paying attention. He's out leading the walk now or trying to. So what you wanna do there is just immediately without saying anything and as quickly as you can, turn around and just walk away. You're power walking in the opposite direction. So you're kind of trying to do that without him noticing. You're trying to get him to hit the end of the leash when you turn around. So he gets a leash correction at the end of the line, turns around, realizes that you've lost him, has to run to catch up with you. And from that point, he's more likely to go, hurry, I'm gonna stay where I can see you. So that doesn't happen again. You can't get away from me. I'm following you. So as quickly as you can, 180, you're trying to do it without him noticing or too fast for him to turn with you. You don't stop walking after you turn. You just turn and power to walk away. If he was too far behind you, good boy. Like you stop to smell something or something like that. Again, don't stop walking. Keep walking. If anything, walk faster instead of slowing down to wait for him or to tell him to come along. You might be getting the idea at this point, you don't wait for him to do anything or ask him to do anything. You tell him what we're doing and then make him do it. So if he's staying back, walk faster. And if you need to, use a leash pop up towards you to bring him back up to your side as you walk. So he did not get to stop and sniff what he wanted. He just ended up back at your side and he got a little leash correction along the way. Then the other thing that you wanna do is when you stop, we want him to sit until you're ready to go again. So for that one, when you stop, if he, he's not in the heel right now, but if he was in the heel, we'd want him to sit automatically at your side. When he does that, he would mark right or just give him good boy you're an amazing boy yeah you're so smart whoa so make a big big deal out of it this is not a pet pet it's a party for him when you're ready to go again and of course if you didn't sit you just use a leash pressure sit right away when you're ready to go again you would either tell him heal or free Free means, all right, the walk is done or your healing is done. You can go where you want. Go potty, go sniff stuff, go run around, run into the house, run out the driveway, whatever it is, he's no longer required to heal. Or if you're going to walk again and you still want him healing, you tell him, I'm about to start walking, which is heal. 
So we're in a little bit of a small space to heal, but we'll try to show you what these pieces look like together. Heel. Heel, then start walking. Keep them at your side. Good boy. We want them kind of matching your pace. Good boy. If you slow down, he slows down. If you speed up, he speeds up with you. When you stop, you want a sit. Good job. Yay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What a good boy. Heel. If he goes out ahead of you, turn around. Good boy. Wow. Good job. Yeah. Break. Good boy. Good boy. We'll take another video outside so you can see.